what's up guys and in today's video i'm going to be showing you my prison that i've built and this prison has taken me over 50 hours to build and over 2 million dollars so if you guys could please like subscribe and comment down below that would be very appreciated now if you didn't notice by that little segment this prison actually is a prison that i've used before that i built in a video about a year ago if you guys want to check that out i'll definitely leave it in the description so right here at the front there's this nice little entrance building um i think it's just nice to like grab people's attention because if they're driving past they're like "Ooh, that's a big prison and then they want to come check it out um so i have raised this so i can fit my military truck through um and then right in here i have the wanted board and the other side i have the other wanted board and yeah i don't have any use for this building yet but maybe i'll find one um and then coming into the parking lot um there's these nice cars everywhere i think it just fills in the parking lot a little more because without these it would just be a piece of asphalt and would kind of be bland so then yeah this is this is the main building right here um it is pretty pretty large uh there's like three three little uh roofs right there i think it looks pretty cool and then walking in here to the reception it's a nice little big open space right here with the reception desk nice open space somebody obviously must have spilled something um and then walking into here Right back here is like the main little like office area. Not main office area, there's a bigger office, uh, which I'll show you guys, but yeah. And then right in here, it's a little break room for the officers if they just wanna have a little chill time. And then I'll show you guys the infirmary over here. It is a small infirmary, but I didn't really have enough space to make it bigger whenever the update came out. So it's just small like that for now. And then coming into the main hallway right here, you'll see there's a little catwalk up there. And you'll see there's another one up there. And I'll get to that later. It's pretty cool. But yeah, walking down the hallway, it is a little dark in here. I don't really like that it's so dark. But, you know, sometimes you gotta make sacrifices. Um, and then right here in the first cell block. I already covered this in detail in the video, so I'll just skim past that. And then I'll go over here to the cafeteria, which is also another cool, cool thing about this prison. Um, it is very big, and I'm also using the Halloween table, so it is pretty unique, um, as you wouldn't be able to do this right now. Um, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if they added, added in the tables in this Halloween update. But yeah, and then behind each of these doors on each side, there also is, um, I don't know why there's medkits in here. But here is where the people make all the food yeah, on this side. I'm pretty sure you guys can guess that's more cells over there. So I'm not going to cover that. Um, and then here are the showers. So showers on that side, showers on this side. Kind of a pretty symmetrical prison. Um, and then let me walk over here and show you guys the yard. All right, so this is the yard. It's kind of boring, I'm not going to lie. But there's not really a lot to add to the yard. Except kind of like a nice little chill out area with some phones. And then over here is a basketball court. I tried my best with the markings, but obviously you can't get that detailed in this game with the blocks and stuff. Um, yeah, that's the whole yard. All right, now this is a flaw with my prison. Now there's only one, um, one stairway that leads to the other two floors, uh, which kind of does suck, but you know, that's kind of what you have to deal with. And then right over here in this little area, it's kind of like a little, yeah, I don't, I don't really know what to call this in here. A little waiting area. Um, here is the workshop. Now there is another workshop in the prison, but this is the smaller version in here. Um, it's the original workshop, and then that leads outside. And then right here is the visitation. So over here would be for the prisoners, and then over here would be where the um, people come talk to their family and friends and stuff like that. And then let me show you outside real quick. So you can walk out here and there's nothing really back here except the doggy pen over here. Um, just to keep the dogs kind of happy if they want to come hang out over here. And then you can leave the prison right there too. And then let me walk upstairs. I am pretty proud of the stairway. It is pretty cool if you do ask me. And you can get up to the roof from here. The only spot that you can actually get up to the roof. And then let me go back down to the second floor. Now there's not much on the second floor except this little office area, so in here could maybe be where the warden sits, um, maybe like the counselor, maybe like a couple other important people for the big offices, and then inside of here is another break room with the foosball tables and a little pool table, and it also has a nice little balcony so they can look 
look on in the forest. So that is the whole entire second floor. Um, pretty tiny. And then right out here is another balcony, which is pretty cool. And then right in here is where the big office is at. This is where all the prisoners, or not prisoners, where all the guards can like look at all the monitors. But then here is the third floor. This is just like a little main commons area with some TVs, some couches, nice view over the prison and the city. I think it's pretty nice. And then over here is the other workshop. I didn't add any, any lights in here, but I think this window gives it enough light in my opinion. Um, also the window right here. So yeah, it's a pretty nice area in here. And then if you walk out and go this way, I think you can see right here is the workout room. Um, it's very bright in here. I kind of hate that, how these lights actually light everything up like that. It's kind of weird. Um, but then also right in here we have solitary confinement for if the prisoners are being bad. And then we also do have, like, I really don't know what this is supposed to be, but maybe it could be like, what's that stuff called? It could be like volleyball maybe, where they like throw the thing over. I was just trying to fill up space um, and making a little sports room in here. And this is a cool view up here because you can look down on everybody else and I think it looks pretty nice. Alright, now walking over here, here's a little armory in here. I think it just fitted pretty well to have these lockers and stuff for a little armory. And then right over here is the other sports room with the mats. I think it looks pretty cool in there. And then another solitary confinement because obviously I have to have 10 of them, 10 chairs. So I think that's pretty cool. And then over here, this is the last part of the prison I'm gonna show you guys today, and this is the library. So also, again, it's very fucking bright in here. I don't know why it's that bright. Um, please fix the lighting game. But yeah, there's a lot of books everywhere on the walls and stuff. And then you can just sit down, do your studying um, while you play foosball. And yeah, I think that's the whole prison. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, and comment down below, and join the Discord server first in the description. And yeah, I'll see you guys later.